uh, I'm going to show you this one app that could be the only app you need to run for your Shopify store. So definitely make sure that you stay all the way to the end of this video so that you can see all the value of this one app. So this app that I'm going to be showing you today is called Vitals. Vital. Anyway, just type it in. Vitals or Vital. V-I-T-A-L. And definitely make sure you stay all the way to the end of this video so that you can get all the, see all the value that I want to show you for you to help you with your Shopify store. Move bug, move fly. Sorry about that. It's fly on the screen. Um, so here we are at Vitals. It has, oh, I was wrong. It has 40 apps in one. We're going to click on it. We're going to take a look at what all comes with it. Now, I've been using this for one of my other Shopify stores. It's a test store that I'm running. I want to just, it's a one product store right now. And I've been using Vitals so far. It has been helping me convert. So I said, why not show y'all what's been working for me? Because that's what I like to do. So let's scroll down, take a look. We're going to take a brief look at the video that they have here. We know you love your Shopify store. I'm going to mute that. So here we have a nice video showing what Vitals can do. I'm going to scroll down. Yeah, you're not really going to get the gist of it because I muted the sound. But come to the app.shopify.com, type in Vitals, check this out. You can watch that video. I don't want to do it because, yeah, I just don't want to do it right now. So we're going to click right here. I know some of y'all are already wondering what's the price. I'll show you the price. Once I show you the price, don't run away from the video because I still got to show you all the other apps. But just in case you're wondering, it is you get a seven day free trial. So if you installed it today on September 20th, 2019, you'll get it's free seven days till September 27th. Then you'll be charged thirty dollars a month, 40 apps for thirty dollars a month. You can't really beat that deal. So let's see what those 40 apps are that you're going to be getting. The first one is product reviews. Receive and display reviews with photos, import them from looks. I think that's how you say it. Review, yacht, yacht po, or judge me. Honestly, out of all these, the ones you want to use is looks. I've been using looks for my um, other stop, Shopify store. It looks very amazing, especially when you send in mobile users to your store. I would definitely aim for Luke's. That is the best one that out of all these that I've, well, I haven't tested the other three, but I'm telling you right now, I've been using Luke's and I have, my sales have been amazing. So that is the one I would choose, but that's just my own experience. You're welcome to try the other three as well. Next, they have the currency converter. This is very important when you learn how to send, when you learn how to send traffic from different locations and countries and they might speak another language other than English. My suggestion to you is for this to work and not to over over exert yourself or hurt your brain. All you need to do is go to Google, go to Google.com, type in Google Translate and whatever language you want to set it from in your ad that you want to send people to, you just go type in, you copy your text from your Shopify product page, you paste it in the Google Translate. It's going to be set to English. And then when it says English, you want to switch it over to the language that you want to set it to. That will work best. But if you just want to keep it the way how it is and you don't want to do all that, all you have to do is come over here to currency converter. When they land to your page, you're going to have the option to choose. So normally it's going to be set automatically to USD. But if let's say you want to send someone from I don't really know any other currencies off the top of my head, but they have the option when they go to your page, they can click on it and it'll switch to over 160 plus local currencies. So that's another way if you were wondering about how you can send traffic from other locations across the world to your store and they don't know how to pay a USD or are not available to pay in USD. This is a good alternative for that. Next, we have the Wheel of Fortune. Pretty sure you're familiar with that is when you come to a Shopify store or a product page and then the big spinning wheel comes, say, hey, submit your email for a chance to get one of these discounts. That's what that is. Next, they have a product bundle. It says, look and feel like Amazon's frequently bought together. So when a person comes to your Shopify store, they add the cart. 
they will hopefully have at least a few products on your store and they will pop up pop up at the bottom and say, hey, you we seen you added this to cart. Here are some other products that I frequently bought together along with this that'll help increase your AOV, show for average order value, and increase your sales. Next, they have a volume discount for bulk purchases. This is very good if you're selling a product that can be bought in multiple. Um, so an example off the top of my head, let's just say sunglasses. It's like these pair of sunglasses, like one, it's one pair of glasses, but they have five different ways that you can use the glasses. And if you were to sell this in like quantity breaks, they can, you can do like buy two, get 5% off, buy three, get 10% off, buy four, 15% off, buy five, get 20% on and so on and so on. That's a good way to also increase your profit margin as well as average order value for your store. Recent sales pop. Sales pop is when you on when a customer comes to your Shopify store and assuming that you made a sale, it'll show all the sales from different locations, states, cities, or where previous customers have bought. It also makes your store look very trustworthy and appealing, showing that other people have bought here. And along when you plug this in with looks review, it also sort of reviews, so it looks like you're a trustworthy brand. You definitely want to install this app, but don't leave this video just yet because I'm not done. So next we have trust sales and badges. Pretty sure you know what trust sales and badges are. It's just a way of a showing that we accept payments from these credit cards and we are secure network. We're not going to steal your information, not going to sell your information, nothing like that. It's going to have payment logos from Visa, MasterCard, PayPal, etc. And it's just a way to make your store look that much more trustworthy. Then it has 30 plus more apps, Facebook Messenger, Live Chat. You want to have this. You also want to have a Messenger bot on your store so that people can not only opt into your email list, but also opt into your Messenger bot. Because I'm pretty sure if you have, if you're not aware already, people check Facebook Messenger a lot faster than they've checked their email. So I'm pretty sure if someone sends you a message on Facebook, you stop, you hear that ping, and then you go, "Oh yeah, this is a good way to." This is a good. That is a good method for abandoned carts. I'm actually testing that out myself, and I'm also in the same process using that to build up a secondary list for my VIP customers. So that's just a, another hidden gem for you. Next, they have Instagram feeds, um, countdown timers. Recently, in the past few years, countdown timers were successful. However, I'm not going to say that's not successful, but customers have caught on to countdown timers and they realize that that fake scarcity doesn't really work. So, I mean, to each his own. You can test if you like, but I just wanted to put that out there. Next, they have the cookies bars. SEO boosting alt tags for those of you who like to do SEO. They have description tabs. This has been something that you see in the premium, premium themes of the Shopify store. Most of them have like description tabs, say description, reviews, and then something else over here. Helps your store look that much more professional. I just got a notification, so that's what that sound was. Didn't mean to scare you. Next, they have the free shipping bar. It's just a bar that I'll place at the top of your store. It says free shipping worldwide, yada, yada, yada. Sticky and animated add to carts. These are my favorites, not only because they look cool, but when the customer's scrolling through your product page and they get to a part where it says add to cart, you add to cart, you can make it so that it shakes every few seconds. And is that more appealing to the eye? So the customer will be like, yeah, I really want to get this. And it's, it's just fun. And it, it's been converting very well for me. Um, next, they have social media buttons. So you can upload your stores, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Pinterest, YouTube. Just another way to build your following. Perfect together. We never edit your theme. No coding required. Tegregates with Oberlo, AliExpress, Facebook Metrics. Facebook Messenger, Clavio, Card Hook, and OCU. I don't know what that is. So we're going to look at some pictures here to get a look, and I'll show you an example store. Um, some nice reviews. So, yeah, this was the currency converter I was telling you about. So they can just click on there up there and then change the um, currency to whichever currency they have in that location of whatever country that you're sending them to have a messenger chat for your Facebook messenger. You definitely want to make a messenger bot 
That's something I can't stress enough for you. Next, you'll have your social media icons and your buttons over here to go to your store, business, or brand social media page. Volume discount. So, yeah, this is what I was talking about. Buy two, 10% off. Buy five, 20%. Buy 10. I think that says 40. Can't really see. Then, once they add the cart, what you see here is frequently bought together. It says this item, short sleeves, yada, yada, yada. Trust seal badges. These actually are very high quality and uh, some of the best trust seal badges I've seen in a while. This is a product reviews. I don't know which one out of four this is, but it definitely looks good so far. Content protection, prevent theft by disabling right click and more. Oh, so this is to stop like other people who might come across your store, your product and try and steal your images. Apparently you can set up content protection so they're unable to do that. That's something I have to implement on my store. Um, cookie bar, this is just for respect to EU law and GDP showing that customers, when they click on this, they understand that basically we're going to retarget them if they don't buy and send them more offers that we have for our store. That's just the short version. If you want to look more into that, you're more than welcome to Google it. Quick search is just another way for customers to come to you. Oh, no, this is for us. Quick search is a way just to, out of the 40 apps, if you just want to go to one specifically, you can just type it in and um, go straight to it instead of scrolling through the other 39. Suggested features just show us new apps, preview, yada, yada, yada. Here is the countdown timer, animated add to cart, payment logos, recent sales. This actually looks very high quality, looks good. Smart bar. Um, yeah, this is where you'll put free shipping worldwide. Or since holidays coming up, you can do something about a Halloween sale, Thanksgiving sale, Black Friday, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So that's just a brief photos. Don't leave yet because I'm not done with the video. Yeah, so they only got yeah one off at thirty dollars a month. So let's take a look of how this looks on someone's store. I'm gonna click right here. Open link in the new tab. Don't wait for this to load up. If you're enjoying the video thus far and you're still here, help your boy out. Give your boy a like, a thumbs up on this video. Helps increase my viewer duration. And it also helps this video get shown to other people on the YouTube algorithm because they base this off of likes, comments, subscriptions. And I appreciate if you could also leave a comment below. Tell me how much you like this video and if you like this type of content. But don't leave out. That's not my closing exit. And I'm still here recording the video. So let's take a look here on some random store. You can see the social media icons, currency right here. So USD, uh, Europe, Britain, Canada. I'm assuming that's Australia. Here comes the spinning wheel. Yep. Pretty sure you're familiar with those, used to seeing those. Um, uh, log in the messenger, so here you are. This is where people can write you on Facebook Messenger and ask any questions that they have. Let's take a look at, let's look at this mug, see what happens, see what, see what it shows us if once we land onto the product page. Right, this is just a mug. Pretty sure this is an example store. So they didn't really put too much effort into it. They just want us to see what it looks like. Here is the countdown timer that they have. Seven hours, 17 minutes. As you see, the add to cart button is popping up at us. I believe they have their set for at least every 10 seconds, maybe 15 seconds. Let's take a look. Yep, there it goes, bouncing, bouncing around. Um, it is the messenger bot again. Uh, you can't see it, but this is a big add to cart button. So while I'm scrolling down, it's still going to have the option for me to add to cart. Here's the security badges that they have. You can also include um, the shipping options. This is another good way to let your customers know in advance because we all know AliExpress takes uh, anywhere from 10 to 20 days to deliver a product. So that's always good to have. This product has no reviews. Other products have reviews. These are uh, customers who bought this also bought. This is a good way to increase your upsells. Uh, frequently bought together. Got that there. And um, 
yeah, that's a good look. So I've already added this to my other store. I'm going to be running some ads next week. I will give y'all an update following up on this video how my sales did, how my conversions did. Um, but yeah, this is a good way to save you a lot of money. You're getting 40 apps for the price of $30. If you were to add these apps individually, one by one by themselves, I guarantee you're going to be paying at least $250 at minimum. Probably higher than that, but that's just the average minimum. So definitely take advantage of this app. I'm not an affiliate for this app. I just wanted to showcase this app because this app has been working for me and it saved me a lot of time for all the other apps that I need when it's an all-in-one app with 40 different apps in one.